juice. I got the juice. Boy, well, yeah, I got the juice. Boy, yeah, I got the juice. I got the juice. Boy, yeah, I got the juice. I said I got the juice. Yeah. What's going on, guys? It's your boy Untap Juice here with the juice, back with another boop, 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 banger video, man. Today's video, man. Look, you guys went absolutely crazy on the how to wrap up fast in NBA 2K22 video. You guys went absolutely crazy, so it's only right for me that I give you a part two. Cause yes, you guys know that. You know what you don't need to do, and you know what you need to do to hit level 40, but you also got to know how to win. And in today's video, I'll be explaining to you guys exactly how to do that. But without further ado, man, let's make sure we get the video up to 30 likes. You guys know the vibes. And hit that subscribe button. Turn on post notifications, and let's get right into it, man. Hey, if this tutorial helped you out as well, make sure you hit that like button. Hey, I got, I got to put an announcement. I got a quick announcement. A lot of you guys added me on PlayStation. All right, please send me a test message because I get a ton of friend requests. Send me a test message. And I'm gonna I'm gonna add you guys to a group chat so that everybody that's on the PS4 side of things or PS5 side of things, we're all in the same community. We're all in the same voice chat. We communicate and we can get people to play with. But without further ado, let's get straight into the video. All right. So as you guys can see. I'm running park with my boy Sergio and my boy Feptix, aka that dude. You feel what I'm saying? All right, look. Shout out to Vince Sergio. His link to his channel will be in the description below. He's the one that actually showed me this defensive setup for NBA 2K22, and it works immaculately. All right. So the lineup that you want to have basically is a ISO and guard, a lockdown, and a big man. We all know that. But the defensive schemes that you want to run, you want to have your lockdown grab ball. You want to have your ISO and guard grab the ball up top, and you want to have your big man basically hedging, helping, doing all the dirty work that you need. And that's basically step number one. So once you got those builds in the same vicinity, all you have to do is orchestrate and put them together and make sure you guys working well, make sure you guys blend well. And the only way you can do that is communication and plan together. You know what I'm saying? Scared money don't make no money. So if your if your record is low and it's, you're getting sold, don't get mad at the game. Adjust. You gotta adjust to the meta of this game, and the meta of the game this year is basically the same as it was in 2K20, the same as it was in 2K19. Either you're gonna get hit with a bunch of screens, or you're gonna have an ISO and guard, and you just have to be ready. And with this lineup, you can have you're ready for all sorts of income. You're ready. You're ready for it all. You're gonna be a de a demon on defense. Look, as you guys can see. We're rotating, we're rotating, and yes, they had three out there, but we're just rotating with communication that. So now that we know that we gotta rotate a little bit better, make sure that we're communicating on those switches, it's not gonna help. <clears throat> mm, excuse me, guys. It's not gonna happen on the next drop. All right. Communication is key when it comes to winning. All right. Second thing that you guys need to know is make sure your badges are adjusted to the people that you're you are playing with. All right. If you playing with somebody that needs a little bit extra boost to their shooting, make sure you're running full general, make sure you're running diamond to help out your teammates. Helping out your teammates is probably the most comfortable way that they can play and make sure they're playing the right game and they're not selling you and you guys are getting dubbed. That's basically it. Make sure you got your badges adjusted to your teammates and not more so yourself. If you're a point guard, listen, most guards, if you're an ISO and guard, you kind of get excused from this because you kind of need those badges to make sure that you can be effective on the floor as well. But if you can take off something to try to help out your teammates, make sure you please do. All right. And when it comes to winning, this game is very offensive oriented. But if you guys want a, a video on how to play defense really, really well on this game, I will really break down the whole defensive scheme and the whole mecca for this game. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys want that. But as you guys can see, we just had an amazing defensive stop there. And basically, all we did that whole drive was communicate. All right. Now, it's, it's going to take some time. If you're new to 2K, it's going to take some time to get used to it, all right? And it, it's not going to come overnight. It's not going to come the next day. It's going to take some time. I'm not saying it's going to take a week. It's going to take you a couple tries to get it right, get it together, all right? And that's basically all you need to do in order to win every single game. Guys, I have a 75 win percentage. I barely lose. And if I do lose, good game. 
That's all it is. It's a very good game. It's not like we're out here getting blown out the water. Games are very competitive. Games, we can face comp. It's not a problem. Hell, we are the comp. You know what I'm saying? If you want to become a comp, if you want to become comp, make sure you take these tips and you be effective. All right? Third number tip. And this is the final tip. I don't know why people don't do this in order to win. People, it's a pride thing, I believe. And that is buy boost. Y'all, boost has been effective in 2K ever since we have park cars in 2K16. I don't know why people don't like buying boost, but you really should consider getting boost for your build. The only thing it does is enhance your abilities. People are like, oh, it's a cheat code. Oh, you suck if you use boost. Nigga, no, you're, bro, you're fine. Please use boost. It's only going to help you throughout the long run. Please, 100 times percent, check your boost. Make sure you have Gatorade. Make sure you go to the Gatorade facility and make sure you have your physical boost that you also get for training in the Gatorade facility. All right? Practice makes perfect, guys. And not everybody's perfect. And those boosts is going to make you perfect. All right? But that's pretty much it for the video. If you guys liked it, like I said, like goal for this video today is going to be 30 likes. Let's make sure we hit that subscribe button. Comment, like, and subscribe, turn on those post notifications. And without further ado, man, it's that boy Juice. And we out, man.